Hey guys, welcome back to my FIFA 17 career mode with Arsenal. To kick off this episode, we've got Manchester City at home. Normally, that's a really tough fixture, but looking at the table, they have not started very well. They're down in 11th, and I saw the comments. Everyone thought it was very funny that Chelsea are bottom of the league without a win. That is pretty crazy. Liverpool also not starting so well this season. But anyway, we're going to get into the first game of the episode right now. If we can pick up three points here, we should be back into the top four, providing other teams maybe don't pick up points. That'd be nice. Let's get into the game. At the moment, guys, we are the best defensive team in the league. And it was the same story last season. Defensively, we're looking good. But as you know, I've mentioned it a few times already in season two and towards the end of season one. I don't score enough goals. Hopefully we can change this. I'm hoping that Man City are playing three at the back. That seems to be quite a common thing for City these days. But anyway, this is the lineup I've gone with. It's one of the strongest teams I can put out. I'm really, really going for it. I want to get a win against Man City today. Pep Guardiola's men, though, are not going to be easy. Are they playing three at the back? No, they're not. So in the recent career mode update, their default formation is 3-5-2 but it's still 4-3-3 by the looks of it in my career mode. They've got some great players in there. Bonnie's come back from his loan at Stoke. He could easily come on and score some sort of crappy headed goal, but they've gone with Aguero for now. It's a very, very strong side. Let's pick up the win. So far, Man City are dominating the possession, but that's fine. I don't mind as long as I'm able to win the ball every now and again, like I've just done here and just get on the attack. Let's flick that on. That is beautiful from Alexis. Here's Sidibe. Back to Alexis, Alexis maybe. This is going to work. Try and whip in across. Oh, it's deflected. Can I get there? No, I can't. That was not probably the best idea to cross it in. Aguero's through here. He's through, but Bellerin, what a tackle. Unfortunately, we haven't managed to keep the ball. And that is going to be a corner. That was dangerous. I'm quite surprised Can Aguero didn't just unleash Fury and just shoot. And that's a decent cross, but Petter checks. So reliable. A couple of minutes until half time. How many minutes is it going to be added time? Two. Okay, two minutes of added time. Surely we can get one more chance out of this. Give that to Griezmann. And now back to Bellerin. Mahrez is going to make his run. We'll pass that inside. Oh my god, that was atrocious. That was really badly done and that's going to be half time. That was a really big chance as well. Oh no, we're in trouble here. Sterling's through. 1-0 to Man City. Very poor defending. I don't know how he found so much space, but it has deflected off Koscielny. I think Czech may have actually saved it. If it didn't come off Koscielny's knee... It wouldn't have been a goal, but I can't I can't say that. You can't guarantee it, so we need to fight back. We need to find two goals to win this game. Verratti on the ball, inside to Ozil. Through for Griezmann. Oh, what a first touch. He's still going here. Still going. Oh, company does so, so well. Can I win it back? That could have easily been a foul. I've just completely ran into him. I don't know how that wasn't a foul. I really don't get it. Oh my god, that should be 2-0. I don't get it. Why are Man City struggling this season? Then as soon as they come to the Emirates, they turn into freaking Bayern Munich. It drives me mad. But anyway, Mares driving forward here. That's going to be a yellow card. That is such a bad challenge from Clichy. We've got Ozil on the free kick. I'm just going to drift this one in and hope someone can get on the end of it. Xhaka was there, but that is going to go out for a goal kick. We've only got 10 minutes left, so I'm going to change things up. Verratti and Mares are both going to come off. Not their best games. Oxley chamberlain and Ramsey, who's in great form right now as an impact sub. <laughs> He's coming on. Here's Ramsey straight away over to Alexis. Going through the middle. Pass it across to Griezmann. What was that? What was that? Why did I pass it then? I should have just had a shot. We go again, though. Griezmann. Yes, he might be through here. Come on. Keep going. Keep going, Griezmann. Keep going. Alexis. No. I should have taken a touch. I am just rushing these opportunities, guys. We've got a corner. Checks come up. It's not a bad delivery, but it's not great. Get it back in straight away. And no one's there. Everyone decided to move away. Absolutely gutted. Man City, mid-table, having a very, very poor start to the season. Comes to the Emirates and they just, yeah, they turn into a much better side. The side that they should be. So, I don't know. Maybe I've just played them at the wrong time. Oh, and of course, this oh, it always happens. This drives me mad. So it's like, you know, have a bad result. Oh, and let's throw you some more shit. Um, Alexis Sanchez says, the problem with the weather is that it makes me feel so depressed. I don't blame him. England is shit for weather. But please, Sanchez, don't leave. We absolutely need you. We're going to do whatever we can to keep him, of course. 
Anyway, into our next game, guys. Round four in the EFL Cup. We're simulating this entire tournament, of course. Let's see if we can get ourselves a win. We do a 1-0 win. Oxlade-Chamberlain scoring after just 22 minutes. And yet again, we progress to the next round. Not too bad. Now it's time to play Newcastle. And as you can see, they're actually above us by two points. So just like the Man City game, we need to pick up three points and go above them. Now, lately, I've been fed up with bringing Ramsey on and realising how good he actually is. So, he's starting today. We're going to drop Verratti. Didn't have a great game in the last one, so Ramsey's going to replace him in midfield. Otherwise, I think it's the exact same team that we used against Man City. Now, I'm really impressed with Newcastle coming straight up after being relegated and starting the Premier League season very strongly indeed. And you can see why. That is a very nice team, you know. Hopefully, though, we can beat it. Straight away, Ramsey's got it. Over here to Griezmann. Back inside for Ramsey. Back in for Griezmann. And then that. That was a shot. Now here come Newcastle with Gufran. He's going to pass this one back to Anita. Inside to Lazar. He's gone through very easily there. And again. And he almost scored. Griezmann here dropping deep. We're going to play that over here for Bellerin. Now Mares, Can you make a run? Try and pick him out. That's a nice ball. Back in for Bellerin maybe. Yes, come on. No. Oh, he's injured as well. Come on. No way. Please get up. Ah, bollocks. Fantastic start to this game. Well, we have no choice but to put Gibbs there. And he's not a right back. But don't forget, guys, we bought Sidibe. That's exactly why I did it. So Sidibe, who is more than comfortable playing at right back, as you can see there. And it means Gibbs comes on at left back. I'm actually finding it quite difficult to break through Newcastle's defence at the moment. Need to do a couple of one-twos maybe with Urzu and Griezmann. Almost made it through that time. We're getting there. Come on. It's been pretty tight so far. I would say we've had the better chances and more of them. But Newcastle are decent, you know. Here's Mitrovic. He's gone around me way too easily. And they're through. Oh, my God. This isn't happening, guys. It's freaking Newcastle. And I can't even defend against them. What Like... I'm just speechless, guys. I don't know what's going wrong. Look at my defending there. Look at that for a finish, though. <laughs> like, that gives me no chance. Wow. And once again, we're 1-0 down, and we've got work to do. Please, just let me get a goal back. Come on. Come on, Ozil. Get me back in this. Through for Mares. Through for Griezmann. Onto the inside. Hit to Griezmann. Oh, do you know what? It's not happening today, is it? It's just not. Granite Xhaka on the run. Through here for Griezmann. Is he through? He's through! He finishes! Come on, we're back in the game! And I've done that stupid celebration again. It's pretty addictive. Just pressing X when you score, but 10 minutes to go, guys. We've been in this situation before. This time, can we turn it around and actually win? Very, very nice goal. Good finish from Griezmann. So this is it, guys. Two minutes added on, and I've got a free kick. I'm going to pass it to Alexis. Don't blow that whistle, ref. Don't you freaking dare. Through one. Keep going now. Keep going. Keep going. Pass it back. Get across in. Go on, Griezmann. Go on. Perez was right there. He literally just came on. Coquelin, can you win the header? Yes, come on. Don't blow the whistle, ref. Please. Please don't blow the whistle. Please. Ah, oh, he's going to blow it. God damn it. In these situations, I just don't seem to get that one big chance that I really need. And we come away with a draw. So that means after 10 games, we are down in sixth place. We've drawn four already. Again, I've already mentioned it this season. We've got to stop drawing games. But actually, in the scheme of things, we're not doing too bad. And we've just had confirmation that Bellerin is going to be injured for two months. He's out for eight weeks with a dislocated shoulder. So it's a pretty bad injury, but it could have been a lot worse. Imagine if he was out for nine months. That would have been terrible. So Gibbs is going to come in at left back. And Sidibe will play it right back for uh, for two months, basically. Now back into the Champions League. And we've got our second game against Sevilla. And they were actually pretty good on match day one. So I'm expecting another good performance from them today. Let's have a look at their lineup. So they've gone with... That is a very similar lineup to the one we played against in the Champions League last season. So it's their 3-5-2. Vazquez, Ben Yedda. Got to be really careful with them. Conor Plianka on the left was just so, so good against me on match day one. Um, we've got Najar coming in to replace Bellerin for this game because Gibbs was pretty tired. So Sadibe goes on the left where he should be really. And Najar is a very good replacement for Bellerin. Very similar players. Very quick. Good going forward. And let's get the win.
Well done, Verratti. Back into the team today. Over to Wilshire. Back to Verratti if we can. Out on the left side here for Alexis. Onto his stronger right foot. Trying to unleash a shot. Go on. Oh, it's deflected off my own player. Griezmann, get out of the way. Oxlade Chamberlain now. Let's power through a few defenders if we can and then maybe find a pass. Yeah, we'll pass it inside here for Verratti. For Jack Wilshere. Oh, never mind. Into Alexis instead. Now it's Jack Wilshere. Back inside his Xhaka. He hits it. And it's a big save by Rico. Still got a few minutes before half time though. Maybe pick out Griezmann. Actually, no. Now Wilshere. Onto his left foot. Go on, Wilshere. Hits it. Oh, it's such a good strike. And yet another save from Rico. And yet again, we failed to score before half time. This is a serious issue for me. I'm having chances, but I'm just not scoring them. Let's go, Oxlade Chamberlain. Let's go. Let's keep going. Keep going. Oh my god, what a run. What a run this could be. Verratti now. Keep going. Over to Oxlade Chamberlain. We're through. No, we're not. Right in the last second. I just give it away again. This is so frustrating for me. And it must be even more frustrating for you watching it. Gets delivered by Alexis. And Koscielny's there. And it's in. It's a known goal off Ibora. And uh, I don't even know how to celebrate that. That is pretty abysmal. But I will take it, guys. We've gone 1-0 up. And Ibora, thank you very much for the own goal, mate. Verratti out here to Alexis. Nice bit of skill. Can we get it back inside again? We can. And Alexis scores. There we go, guys. That is going to wrap up the game. We can win in the Champions League, but clearly not in the Premier League, which sucks. Just a few seconds left of this game. There we go, guys. We do get the win. That was a very impressive display. And finally, some of my chances found the back of the net. And that's going to give me confidence going into the next episode where we've got some big games coming up. But three more points in the Champions League. We're pretty much already going through to the next round. After four group games, we've won three, drawn one, and we are topped by a point. Porto just beat Galatasaray 3-0, so it looks like it's us and Porto going through, although that can change. Sevilla still mathematically can still go through, but it would be very, very difficult for them. So uh, that last game against Porto will be pretty big. That will determine who's going to finish in first and potentially get the easier team in the next round. But that is going to wrap up this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. At the start of the next episode, we've got Leicester, and that should be an interesting game. Make sure you hit like on the video if you've enjoyed it, and make sure you're subscribed to the channel as well. You will never miss another upload, and I will see you in the next episode very soon.